Right, then check on the seating. Make sure there's enough room for Uncle Alfie. Oh, shit. Daniel, you didn't forget about Uncle Alfie, did you? He'll be sitting in the street. <laughs> so, how did Daniel stand by anyway? He tried to unmarried to kill. <laughs> Can you believe that? Are you taking the piss? No. Why? <laughs> What practices? Hello? Get there, how are you going? Yeah, of course not. I couldn't be more than happy to. It's absolutely fine. It's not a problem at all, seriously. Alright, absolutely. See you then. Bye. Shit. What? Would you mind getting out your phone and getting Google Maps? We need to go and get Daniel's and call out Why do we have to? I'm sorry, but what do you want me to do about it? You don't argue with someone, someone whose father just died. They ask you to do something, and you do it. It's like they have some kind of automatic pass. Probably like a death pass. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
not for long actually, me and Jane are moving out. Oh great, so we're going to do a nice different home. Well actually I was maybe hoping you could take it to New York with you for a few months. Take it to New York with me. What are you going to do in New York? Go to parties? No, she's way better off here than Jane, believe me. Yeah, well we've already decided. We need to deposit my house, which reminds me we're going to need that money. What money? The money for the funeral. You agreed to pay half. Remember? Alright. So, well, I don't have it on me, Daniel. I'm doing advance in October. I can get to you in a few months. I can't wait a few months. I need it now. That's just not going to happen, is it? I'm totally skinned. What do you mean you're totally skinned? You're a successful novelist. You have a swanky New York apartment. And do you have any idea what it costs for the upkeep? This size just had to lay out a fortune for the flood over here. Do you understand how much they're charging for first class now? Right. 